back in with you soon on that. Meantime, thousands of potholes around Tampa are no longer a problem because of the Fix It Fast program. Today, city leaders are recognizing the one year anniversary of that effort. Eight on your side's Beth Rousseau joining us live this morning with the work uh, these teams are doing. This is on a daily basis. Yeah, Avery, they're out and about daily doing work like this here on Oak Keller Avenue. You can see the potholes here have been patched up and repaired. During the year that this program has been in place, crews have repaired more than 4,300 potholes and dealt with 7,400 square feet of other minor road issues covered under the Fix It Fast program. The goal is to get all of that done within under 72 hours, and right now their average response time is approximately 46 hours. Still, some families say the roads need to be completely repaved. Earlier this year, the city's director of transportation admitted under the budget Tampa's average street is only repaved once every 75 years. He said instead of spending $5.4 million a year on repaving, they actually need $41 million annually to get the job done every 20 to 25 years and address these homeowners concerns. It hasn't been paved. I don't think since her dad built this house. A lot of pit holes and, you know, haphazard fixes on, on the pavement. Back out here live, city leaders say this is progress, and so they're going to be celebrating the one year anniversary of this Fix It Fast program this morning at 10 o'clock. We're live in Tampa this morning. Beth Russo, 8 on your side.